Hello, everyone. This is ITC Ken, tech engineer. This video is for you to learn more about the configuration of the Luna Cloud Platform PA system. Okay, let's start. This is the home panel for you to check the information of the whole system. And here is the equipment configuration. First, the terminal will show here. When you connect it, the terminal to the switch, then the terminal will show here. Okay, then you can check the status. The status have online and offline. When you connect a terminal to the switch, then you click this register to make this terminal online. Then you can edit the terminal number here, the terminal name and the IP address and the mask and the gateway. When you finish this configuration, the terminal will be online. This is the partition configuration. You can group many terminal to a partition. It means you can call many terminals in one time. Okay, we add a partition here. Then we enter the partition number and the name and the description. Okay, then we can select this partition can be seen by which users. Okay, then we select the terminals we need to add to this partition. This is called configuration. Okay, we have many, uh, we have many intercom panel of this system. Then we can add the call strategy here. Name, description, and the key strategies, okay? When we press the key number one, we have the configuration here, one key help and the one key broadcast and etc. Then the number two key is the same. Okay. Then the time strategy here, if, if you press the, press the key on the term, uh, on the intercom panel, then if no one answer, then the call will be transferred to which one. Okay, you can select the call transfer here, transfer to which terminal and the app terminal here. And this is the volume strategy. We can add the volume strategy for each terminal. Name, description, analog signal, mic, AUX, and the digital signal. Okay, then uh, select the terminal. And switch analog terminal here, the configuration. Also, you can create a user in the user configuration. Press add here, the username and the description and the password for this user. 
and select the level and select the terminal that this user can control and select the terminal permissions okay then the media library here we can upload the mu music file on this PC to our media library and we also can create a channel the channel means means a, a music file holder folder channel number here channel name and the channel description and uh, you can select the channel number on the terminal then this terminal will play this channel play the songs of this channel okay next one the temporary task here when you need to broadcast a music you can use this function okay task name and the music source media play file play and the channel broadcast and the collector select the audio source and uh, select the volume and select the terminal and the terminal you select it will broadcast the music the TTX configuration here you can add and uh, the content you entered will be broadcast to the terminal you select okay the speed and the language and the sound the sound of man and the woman here you can select okay then this information diffusion function is the use for the for integrated with the video intercom panel and we have timer task here the task name and the description okay and we can select the time for each task time switch Okay, the task name and the switch time, start time and end time. And uh, we can uh, config the holidays. Config the holidays to to turn off the timer of a school. And you can check the today's time task here. The time and the task name. And you can also create a temporary timing here. Okay, next one. is the fire alarm strategy create a fire alarm strategy you can enter the name here description and select the terminal and you can select the fire alarm panel 
interface here and select the music file here. Okay. And then remove this here. Online and offline list. And then you can select the terminal which has the source circuit port to trigger a task. Sound pressure list. Okay, and the conversation list here. It's like a lock to record what you did here. System information. Here we'll show this system information and the operating status register information and the application logs. System configuration here. Basic configuration. You can config the system language and the server name and the server password and the device password. and the network configuration. You can change the IP address and the gateway for the server. And the tomes here. Audio mechanism. This will show the priority of each audio type. Real IP service. And the other configuration. Here you can select a file to change the, the web service logo. Update firmware. You can add the update file to update each terminals. And update the server. Back up and restore. And then you can conf config the host server and the spare server. When the host server is shut down, then the terminals can be held by the spare server. And here is to modify the server time. And the restart and shut down here. Okay, that's all about the configuration of this system. Thank you.